Hey everybody, we're gonna go outside and take a look at my new Toyota Sienna 2021 that I'm setting up for van life. I've got the seats out, so let's go take a look here. Okay, so my reasons for going with this vehicle, um, it's a combination of the good gas mileage and um, the climate control. And I think this will be big enough for living. We shall see, and you'll notice right away the seats are gone. So I removed the third row. That was not too difficult. Let's take a look back here. I looked on YouTube for some helpful videos. The only thing that was different on the 2021 compared to the other videos I saw um, was this harness. So this was connected to the seats. You just basically unclip it and it's good to go. Proceed with the same um, undoing of the bolts undoing of the bolts here and the entire rear seat folding rear seat comes out really wasn't that hard to do let's check out the middle row which is of course what toyota says you can't remove but uh shout out to uh brad ling and his awesome video i'll link in the description describing how you go about removing these middle row seats basically you unhook the battery and then you can detach the front and rear bolts and it's good to go. Beyond that, I did some searching on forums for this device, which is an airbag uh, kind of defeater little module. So I have two of these and you plug them into the yellow plugs and that basically fools the airbag system into thinking the airbags are still on for these middle row seats. So you don't get any warning lights or any weird sounds or anything. So that is pretty important. So right now we've got these raw metal seat brackets, of course, and it's not looking very inviting. But what I'm gonna do is I have some three quarter inch plywood and using probably these bolts here um, and then the clips in the back there, the bolts there, Let me come back here, or possibly these bolts here, we'll put in some wood framing and I'll have a three quarter inch plywood deck for pretty much this whole space. I'm gonna put indoor outdoor carpeting so I'll show you that once we get that done hopefully this weekend. And just kind of going basic with a platform in the back. Um, other than that I think I'm gonna tint the windows in the rear here and the side rear with limo tint for some dark privacy and probably put a privacy curtain behind the uh, front two seats. We'll see how that goes. So anyway, let me know if you have any questions. I think this is going to be a good vehicle for van life. The climate control, I guess, is, you know, to be determined how well that's going to work. Hopefully I'll be in good weather and not need to push it too much with the AC overnight. But again, the other second major reason I went with this one is the good gas mileage. I think it's a solid choice. A little expensive to buy, but um, I think it'll be worth it for um, several years of van life. So thanks for watching, and uh, we'll see you in the next video where I show the platform. Take care.